This is one of the Rucker cemeteries of Manita that we first visited sometime in oh, 2018. Um, we took some pictures earlier of what it started, but it's basically unrecognizable as a cemetery. And we've been working for about 45 minutes. Sean's got one big set of clippers and we're kind of pulling live things with vines and removing them. And we've already um, probably exposed about 20% of the cemetery. I think there's nine or 10 markers that are in the 1990 survey. Um, so far, we have exposed John H., Susan, and Susan, Susan's Don's, right? Oh. Is Susan his great grandmother? We have our good friend Don is related or descended through some of these people in here. I don't recall exactly who it is, but that's kind of our big motivation. Um, in addition to the fact that our daughter's school is literally a stone throw away. Um, here is a downed marker. It is Anthony Rucker. Oh, it is Anthony Rucker? Yeah, it's Anthony. That's his. It's Anthony That's Rucker. That's great, great, great grandfather. That's, I guess, John saying who Don has ascended through. There's some fractured stone. Not sure if that's where Anthony came from. We'll have to this figure out the layout. Here, Sean's got a, uh, that's the second um, hard spot you found, Sean? Yeah. Well, in, yeah, it's another one. So there's been two hard spots that are probably stones, whether they're footstones or headstones. Um, like I said, somebody about 10 years ago came and took a bunch of pictures on Find a Grave and this place was cleaned up at the time, really clean. You can see they're building a development. And uh, we were able to very quickly connect with the landowners who were um, very happy to have us tackle the cemetery and uh, get it reset. Um, and they told us that they would be willing to maintain it. So between our daughter going to school basically here and um, motivated landowners to preserve history, we're uh, pretty grateful. So trying to tackle it before things get much greener than they are. Um, We'll see how far we get today. We've got about another 45 minutes till school pick up, so we'll see what we can do.